Hey guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome back to the channel. If you're a subscriber, and if you are new to the channel, please subscribe for more amazing videos. So let's get started. I bought this Von Racer gaming chair from Amazon Canada for $200. And I will let you know if it's worth recommending or not. Let's unbox it and see if this chair is the right one for you. The box that it came with was heavy, though I had no problems bringing it down to my studio since I just had it slide down the stairs. This chair is so easy to put together as you can see it's well packed inside this big box. Since the manual is straightforward, it took me around 45 minutes to an hour to put everything together. The manual was so easy to understand and there were some tools included to make it easier to assemble. The chair comes with a pillow and a back support that you can plug in for you to be able to use it as a massage chair. It's not just any back support since you're able to choose different modes as well. It comes with a cord that you can plug using any USB adapter. You can also recline this chair which is a big plus and I find it really comfortable. I like that it comes with the leg rest and it's so easy to pull and put back on. I really think that this Von Racer gaming chair was well built. Originally, I was looking at Secret Lab Omega, but it's like three times the price compared to this chair. I told myself, why not get this instead and save? Man, I was wrong. I got what I paid for. After almost uh, three months of using it, I was disappointed since there weren't enough foam on the seat and it was really uncomfortable to use for a long period of time. I mainly bought this for editing and live streaming so using this for a long period of time is a must have feature and I can't sit on it for longer than 15 minutes. The front seat is a bit low than the back side and I keep adjusting my butt and really finding the best spot all the time. But still it isn't all that bad and there are still good things about this chair and as I said you can fully recline it and I find it really comfortable. The back support pillow that it comes with is not great but does the job. It's really nice that they included the massage feature and it's usable when you just want to use it to chill or rest. So overall, I really wanted to like this chair and I felt like I wasted my money on this. The good thing about it though was I wasted that money so you don't have to. But seriously, I really wanted to use it often since I like the style but I can really sit on it for a long time since it's not comfortable. That's a really big drawback for me. So yeah, would I recommend it? Well, I don't. I think there are better options out there or on Amazon. And if you have the budget, you can look into other quality gaming chairs. To be honest, the Amazon executive chair that I got years ago is way more comfortable than this and I still use it up to this day. Don't get me wrong, the style is nice and minimalist as well as when you fully recline it, it does the job. And it's comfortable enough when you want to take a break from work. But if you'll use it as a regular chair, the comfort is really not there. So there you go guys, that was my take and review of the Von Racer gaming chair. So let me ask you before I end this video, do you really need a gaming chair? Or a desktop chair or a computer chair is good enough? If so, are you gonna use it for editing or live streaming? or even gaming since it's a gaming chair so anyway guys let me know in the comments below and if you find this video helpful please do like the video and subscribe to the channel as well as hit that bell notification for more upcoming videos thanks a lot for watching guys i really really appreciate you guys watching my videos it means a lot to me and i will see you again next time this has been bernie hippos goodbye for now